Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Midwest Horizon. Today we got a lot of stuff to do. One, I'm coming out here with my drone, checking the field. I saw some weeds out here, like a patch right there. So we might be spot spraying, but our one field way over here, there's some more weeds. Our grass is almost ready to harvest. Uh, we can't spray it no more. Um, can't spray this field no more, I don't think. Nor this grass piece right here. And this field right here is one we're going to try to spray today. We also need to plant some corn today. And I'm wanting to go get a load of sheep. Now, as you can see, they are doing pretty good. Don't hit the tractor or the tank. Don't scare the sheep. They done got three little pads of wool right there made. And uh, I did clean them up last night. So they should be good to go. We'll check them out here in a minute. Um, as you can see, the truck's gone. Put it under the shed there. Uh, probably see the 4955 gone and the other tractor and skid steer. I put everything in the sheds as far as I could. Um, we're going to send somebody right now to go get some sheep. So let me ran my drone here. And uh, see, I got to take that off. As you can see, we're at 388,000 um sheep to animal dealer it's already done so we're just going to drive course stop at the last and help her fill up okay fill up don't wreck on that bridge uh let's go over here real quick and show y'all there they are i got both of them in there um i put the skid steer down here and I also bought a bucket so I can clean. It's a high tip bucket. That way we can uh, clean these sheets right here. And you can see they're doing pretty good on food. Let's go in and check them real quick. Yeah, they're doing pretty good. Don't, don't have to worry about them. There goes my phone again. It never fails as soon as I start recording. Anyway, anyway, um, let's go check out our other farm shop over here. I was doing some cultivating last night, and it rained us out about as soon as we got done with the field, so that's why my money's up there a little bit more. Uh, plus, we don't have the caterpillar no more, the bulldozer. Um, a couple other things we don't have no more. But I put all the seeds out of the planters. Well, all except for one. We can't unload it. But I put them in here. I wish I had a gauge to tell how much. Oh, we can't do the global. But, um. Got some equipment in that. And equipment in that shed. And we got our cultivators out here. Because, well, it was late when we came in. You're probably like, why we got two of these? Well, I took the Udden back because we've had a little trouble with the one that had the uh, uh, Michelin tire man on top of the cab. We This is the same tractor, just that's gone and it's got a little bit more horsepower and they was a little bit cheaper. Um, so yeah, we, we got twins now and uh, also bought a cultivator so we got twins on the cultivator and I might well say we got twins over here. I was going to get rid of these guys, but they do come in handy on the smaller fields. Plus, I can always put four, I put four guys in the same field last night to hurry up and get done before the rain. So, 4640 with a chisel. These are actually like cultivators. Should be a plow because chisels are plows. Uh, other 4640. All right, come back and check the oil and stuff in them. Uh, we do have a weeder that I could use. But let's go in here and see what nightmare. Oh, bought a pressure washer. But I done that uh, yesterday before the beans. I just forgot to tell y'all. 
Ah, close your eyes and get ready for a big shock. The machine shed is actually full of machines. Got the planter in here. Uh, this right here we're going to get rid of. And the air drill is going back also. So we won't need it no more to plant anything till uh, spring of next year. So why keep it and, and uh, stuff like that when plus the other place can go through it. The John Deere place can go through it and keep it all fancy and cleaned up and stuff and we'll rebuy or rent it or lease it or whatever it's called. Forgot to check the oil. It should be alright. Maybe Mr. Yankee checked it for me. Or Colin. Alright, I'm going to get this going to the market shop. And then I'm going to get the spray rig there. And I'll meet you out on the field over there when we start spraying, okay? Be right. Alright, we're out here, folks. Get my GPS started up here. We're going to go north and south. Um, auto whip. The 120. We'll have to check and find out. Looks like it. I thought this boom was a little bit wider than this. Maybe it's the other one I was looking at. All right. But our tractor made it to the market shop. Um, okay, it looks like we're doing good. Let's go. All right. Auto save got me, folks. Okay. Yeah, it needs fertilizing badly. I've got some weeds here. Uh, 73, 17, 19. A uh, little area here don't need none. Only thing I have to do is 18, 16, and 14, and 13. Um, as you can see, let's go to here. I got soybeans planted all the way out to here. And some here. I made a boo-boo here and here. Uh, wasn't paying attention. But yeah. Uh-oh. Our guys made it to the sheep. Oh, don't. Oh. Real life, I would have hit that pole. Got little patches here and there that's already been fertilized, looks like. I think that's where I made it feel a little bit bigger, too. But it shouldn't take long to spray this. Um... I think what I'm going to do is, let's see, probably going to do a jump cut here and uh, that way I can finish this up and I'll move him to the next field and we'll check on the sheeps, get them loaded up. And that's when I'll bring y'all back is uh, right before I load the sheeps up. And that way we can just get a touch of everything today, you know, just... Uh, Mission Blue doing everything or something. I don't know. But it's got a lot to be done. We got to get that planter done. But as you can look up there, the it, it, ground is still moist. I think it's too too wet to use a planter. It might stick to the disc gains and stuff or whatever, you know, the openers. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to wait a little bit before we plant. But it'll be in this video. Might be a 30-minute uh, video or a little longer, but I think we'll get it done. But anyway, I am so ashamed of myself. How y'all doing, folks? I should have said that first. I'm doing okay. I I'm more worried about y'all. Y'all all right? Starting to get winter for some of y'all. Others are still fighting the heat. I heard up north they're supposed to get 12 to 18 inches of snow. Of course, I live in the middle of 
well, almost middle of the United States. It's Arkansas is a state, and I live in a, the bottom northeast corner, if that makes sense. I'm at the top of the state, you know, north of Arkansas, but it's like two corners. One's up a little bit higher than the other. I'm the bottom northeast corner. Uh, you can Google Blavo, Arkansas, and I'm just south of there. And we're getting like some cool temperatures, and then we get hot, scorching days. So I don't know. Um, but I hope y'all are safe wherever y'all are doing and stuff. Um, last night on the game, and this morning, in real life, we got a bunch of rain and stuff, so cooled us down, but it just made it yucky outside. At least my yard's mowed. Uh oh, patch of weeds here. I wish I had a herbicide in here, too. But anyway, folks, I'm going to, uh, ooh, just had to take a screenshot. I have to do it from that way. But, uh, I will be back in a second, okay? I'm going to finish this field, and we'll go get some sheeps. Be right back. All right, well, the truck has made it to the sheep place. I have it backed up to the door. But I want to go ahead and try to finish this spraying off real quick before I can't spray. Yeah. There goes my phone. And uh, autosave also. As you can see there, I'm working on the last bit, but I'm fixing the. See if I can spray that little bit there. I don't know if I can or not. And then uh, we're going to get the soybean field. And. Yeah, it ain't done on that there. That should be already. Yeah, we got to do this a little bit. Hopefully, I have enough to finish this, and we'll fill up. But as you can see there, from 1817 and 73, all that's ready. I went and tested them, made sure that they uh, wouldn't, you know, turn. So, we like 14 and 13. And also seeing those two little strips I miss, hey, we can do something. I'm going to try, I don't know what to do, try let them grow or what. But anyway, and we are done. Let's get this baby folded up. Uh, we need to start looking at some silos. We ain't got no storage. Uh, need to be getting them looked at and see where we're going to put them. Uh, I need a forklift over here. May I drag this? And we got nine nine three, nine nine three three, then sixty two hundred. We're gonna pull this and out. This, oh, got not grab. Oh 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 ah ah. Uh, oh, uh, it's a little heavy. There I can. It would uh, ask me which one I wanted to fill out of. I don't want to put very much in here, but I want to put just enough to do the bean field and uh, corn, cotton. I'm running on five times now on the time to uh, get that wet moisture sign away. While this is filling up, go ahead and shut it off and let that fill up. I'm going to zoom out just a little and go over here. Visit. Oh, I hit the truck. Huh. I didn't hit the truck, but there you know. Uh, I'm thinking we're going to do these right here. The the doors door set. A large breed of sheep that grows moderately fast has modest wool production. So they should make us quite a bit. I can't remember how many of this trailer holds. So, oh, not too much, I see. Uh, did not even tell us how many. I'll find out here in a minute. Confirm. 
That's not going to turn me on the truck either. Oh, they're all sideways. <laughs> That's neat. Um, trying to see if there's a tarp. But you can't take the tarp off, so anyway. All right, I'm not driving this all the way back. We'll let somebody else. Um, she, she, animal dealer, no. Animal dealer to sheep. First one. Ah. All right, we're going to drive that course. Stop at the last. And uh, Andy's driving it now. Okay. Uh, close enough. We'll run back over here. And what did that give us? 37%, 7,468. That should be well enough for any. All right, folks. I'm going to go over here and see if I can spray the soybean field. Uh, as soon as that cotton, cotton, that wet moisture icon goes away. And just in case. It, whoop, it's this icon right here. That's the wet symbol. It means it's their ground's too wet to do anything. So anyway, I'll be right back. Yeah, this is this a little too wet over here. I'll park it right here for right now, y'all. And I thought I saw our truck coming pretty close. Almost. It's fixing to turn up. So let's go get the uh, planter ready at least. And yeah, so. Wee, it's a long wee. You know, between both of these sheds, I don't know. If, I guess we can always park the, the equipment in here and take the tractors to the other shed. Um, oh, yeah, we. I forgot. We gotta take these tractors. This one's gotta go. Somebody left the lights on. Ah, I can't see. This is an awesome planter, but I think next time we go plant, we're gonna get one that's a lot bigger. A lot bigger. Extra set of wings there. Bigger. Yeah. Now let me uh, do no course loaded. I want my main farm to market. That's what I'm wanting. Oh yeah, we need to spray the weeds too before it gets too far gone. Alright, can we drive course from here? And it looks like we can. I'm just going to trade those 4960s in. They just don't do course play very well. Alright. And I got some other stuff. I keep popping up in that. Let me do it this way. No? Maybe? There we go. And we still got... Okay, that's our farm there. Uh, let's see here. Auto save, auto save. What are you doing to me? I'm probably not going to cut these auto saves out this time because it, it just kind of helps me out. I don't know. I might. Yeah, this is where I need it to be. I, I'm not going to trade no tractors in right now until we get doing hay. And I want to make sure I got enough to do everything. Let's repair that for them, $32. And we're going to get 30452 back. So uh, we're going to sell that.
Okay, I'm just going to pull this tractor out of the way. That way when the oven gets here. We're up to 411. Now you probably think, oh, why don't you pay that back on the loan? Well, folks, I have to get a combine. I really don't know which combines I'm going to get. Um, probably start out small, go big. Might get two. Let's look at them real quick while we're waiting here. Let's see, combines down here. And I'm going to just grow all the way over because I don't want to end game. Oh. See, these are 30,000. I could go ahead and get my old 60,000 liters. Woo. Thought about getting, thought about getting this right here. I don't know how well it's going to work. Two wheel drive. Might get that right there. Of course, GPS. But it's either between them or. Thing about this 9x series, uh, which will go, you can do a, a 9610, which is pretty good size combine. And I think they'll be able to load into the green buggy. So, yeah, I, I can buy them now, but. You know, we'll get stuff at midnight. And then this is the better ones right here. So, yeah, not too many to choose from, but we'll go through, test some out. Uh-oh, I got to reach the shop. Yep. Oh, the sheep farming way. Stop driver. Well, I'm going to have to back these in and hope they don't uh, escape on me. I wonder if I can pull it. Nah, this thing is too long. Wish it would tell me how many is in there. Three. I see 16 butts there. <laughs> no, maybe it's right. Alright, let's, let's see how good Mr. Blue's backing skills is. I might have to edit this out. Slow, slow down, slow down. All right, I'm going to stop right here and open the gate. Y'all so stiff. Y'all ain't going to say nothing. Got a new home. I need to put a tree out here too before summer comes. Ah, hung on my shirt. See, the uh, dialogue box where you actually do it from uh, here is right here. And it shows we got 12 now. Let's see what we actually get. I just hope I don't have to back it all the way over there. If I do, that's going to be, woo. Can't hardly walk this morning. All right, let's back up and see where that box is. It should be right there, but I don't see nothing yet. Uh-oh. Well, that's hanging me. Alright folks, this is probably going to take me a little bit to get this in there, and I want to do some planting too, so I'm going to do a jump cut, and I'll be right back, okay? Ah, right. confirm, 
Don't ask, folks. Don't ask. These sheep are picking my trailer and my truck up. Look at there. Uh-oh. All right, I had to pick the trailer up and bring it back out here. It, it, what it is, is the sheeps are in the way. And you just you can't back up in there. Uh, next time, I'll probably try pulling around. That part, you know, like uh, going over through here and around. Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell y'all, at 6 o'clock this morning, they came out and put this guy up. Big old tank right here. Got some plumbing they're going to do. Uh, our little pump only does like 15%. Uh, this guy here with a whole bunch of water. And you see, construction of your new lizard water filling system has started. Installation will be completed in seven hours. So, in Seth Myers, we'll have all the water we want for the sheeps. Now, let's see how the sheeps are doing. Yeah, I didn't want that. But, no fertilizing missions. Uh, as you can see, the water's going down. But they still got water. So, they should still be producing. Uh, they, they still got a bunch of food. I haven't fed them anything yet. They're eating off the grass out here. So I like it. All right, let's uh, see if I'm inside the trigger. Nope, over here. There was a bald spot here, and I guess the grass then growed over it. I can't find the trigger. Oh, there's one of the markers is it this way there we go we now have 28 sheep or sheep 28 sheep I think I'm gonna buy two more uh, what we got that doors F was the one I see medium grade it is for wool production let's go with this one I just, I just, I don't know. We'll stop right there. It's, it's even 30. Y'all take reference to that. Um, as far as the grass and the water, everything's okay. Um, they don't need to be cleaning yet. So now we got to do is let these babies get big and grow us uh, some precious wool that we can sell, make money off of. Because, oh, man. I still got 410,000. I'm trying not to blow none of that. Ooh, I about to shut that door. He's getting close. Oh, okay. It's close. You're not getting out. You're not. All right. I'll be right back. All right. It looks like this is going to be a lengthy video because I keep on coming up with stuff to do. But we're going to drop the sprayer off here and we're going to grab the weeder. I'm going to keep the front tank on there just for weight purposes. We're going to go over here and grab the weeder. I'll just look at the tractor sitting out in the line like that. Uh, I love seeing machinery like that. But, you know, those things use a lot of money when they're hired workers working in the field. But, uh, yeah. I think I'm on... Uh, I do have a thing coming up. It might be in the next episode. Um, this company reached out to me and they're wanting a test run, a plow. And if I like it, you know, of course I'll buy it. But if I don't like it, well, you know, it'll just be a demo. But what I'm seeing so far, I think I'm going to go ahead and buy it. But, we'll, uh, you know, lease it first, see what it looks like for a couple hours, and then we'll not buy it. Uh, it'll be for the bigger tractor, though. Um, which we shouldn't have no problems with. Uh, 
think we got what uh, 8235 or around here somewhere or 8400 something like that around here all right what we're going first is going to go way over here and while we're going over there let's go to let's go to our as you can see we got some weeds up in our beans so far and 18 and 73 we got weeds um, so what I'm going to do I'm just going to spot do it and just spot weed that way you know if it's this little bit grown here and there we'll just rip those weeds out real quick and you know fast forward the time a little bit to what we need anyway um let's, I don't know oh it's way on down because I can't hire a worker right now with this and this would be cheaper than buying herbicide at least for right now you know I, I gotta get some, some money saved up because I don't want to do my uncle wrong and not pay him when harvest time comes so that's why I'm trying to make sure I get up to a million but he knows I gotta buy combines and stuff so uh, he just told me after harvest pay him whatever so I'm gonna make sure let's see, let me turn a little But um, 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 that's all I like to say is but um, but but oh, I wish I could quit doing that in a way. Yeah, you know, uh oh, that didn't work on them. Might buy some herbicide after all. I, I, ew, that's, that's gonna, it's gonna hurt people, that's gonna hurt, but I'm just gonna do, if I have to spray, I'll do this too, but I'm gonna get off here, I might be able to get some of these, but I'm gonna get off here, and when I come back, I'll be done weeding, and, uh, we'll do some, uh, corn planting okay be right back all right our time has uh got the more the more short symbol up there is gone now we just gotta get some seeds here which it might have enough but i don't know i just uh and i didn't want to do that let's see let's do this put them on the ground here oh better shut this off I want to, I don't know what happened to my speed, it's got really, really too fast, I think I hit a wrong button, fire speeds time 4, I need to figure out how to get that back off, because it's making it hard to pick up stuff and carrying it. We're going to ease this pallet. Oh, whoa. Okie dokie. Yeah, I'm, I'm strong. I'm really strong, ain't I? We'll just back up to it. How's that? We got probably enough in here. We can't unload, but we're going to be planting corn. And I need to change that when I'm thinking about it. There we go. Uh, these here, I cannot, these seed bags here, or pallet of seeds, I can't put in our storage deal over there. So I don't know what to do. I don't. I really don't. But when you come back, you might see the money down a little bit lower, because there is a couple things I want to buy. I want to get, like, a grain bin ordered, and then get it set up, and, uh, and um, yeah stuff like that you know 
So I might be, I want to do first lab missions or contracts, whatever you want to call them. Well, this is going to fill us completely up. Oh, it would be two bags left on there. Okay, to the field we go. All right, folks, I'm going to decide to start over here by uh, the edge of the this other guy's field here. And I want to leave a just enough for like a little turn road down through there. Let's see here. I want to do this this way this time. Just kind of with an angle right there. Kind of hard to stay on that. They're bumpy like that. Let's see if that did it. Yep, that looks set right there. So I need to redo my course. I mean, my GPS too, and my course play. Let's see. I think I'm gonna start about right here. So turn planner on. We are set to corn, and let's go. This tractor really plants it too fast, but most of the time I think they go like nine mile an hour. It'd be high, I guess. Let's see how it's looking. Okay, so we're not getting the extra fertilization. And by the way, these two spots and this 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 one and this one. Uh, wouldn't go with the weeder, so I'm gonna get, have to get some herbicide. And yeah, it was getting planted. Let's go one more. And uh, where's our corn? Right here's our corn. You see there, it's planting corn. We're gonna go probably to about this one here. I'm not gonna do very much cotton testing. Um, the simple fact because it's not on this map. Or it's on it, but this here I'll show you. I go right here. No, is it? No, I ain't on this one. Duh, it's on this one. Right there in the middle. Cotton, nada, nothing. So I'm thinking on what did I say? I wrote it down. I think. If I can see, it's kind of dark in here while I'm recording. Day seven. Uh, late spring. Cotton. So late spring on day seven. I'm actually think I'm gonna do maybe day eight or something somewhere in here. But if we go over here, uh, today is Saturday, I guess, and you see average and minimum temperature. We get to Sunday evening. So it's Sunday. Monday, it just ain't very much 60 degree weather. Now, average, we're doing all right. Anything over 61, I say, uh, cotton 61 degrees. So, I'm gonna plant like right here somewhere. I'm gonna plant like a not a long through, it's probably gonna be, uh, not very long, probably semi-length long maybe a little bit more of each like this day then like the second day of this and, and second day of this and, and then so forth so forth and I'm gonna label it each one of them Ooh, we might just use up that seed with corn but there's oh yeah we got this stuff over here dude. I'm gonna go ahead and hire this guy as a worker take GPS off our worker and run over here real quick get out of his way I'm gonna uh, call the people and tell them to come get this wood chipper so they can be tearing it down since it's pretty today and here those woodpeckers but oh, oh, oh get, get out of there I need to figure out how to slow my speed down 
I don't see it nowhere. Well, anyway, this thing's out of wood chips. Uh, it's still got 9,700 liters of fuel in there. I can't do nothing about that. And zero wood chips in there because they're over here. And as you can see, I got things lined up to be moved out. So I'm going to get this guy. You know it, folks. We're going to drive horse. Stop at the last. Right in here should be soybeans, but it should be all right since they ain't popped up yet. Um, this guy's going to go to the farm shop, fill up our diesel tank, and probably get unhooked. Um, I don't know if we really need that trailer or not, but we're going to keep it just in case. Uh, we got to bring a bulldozer back out here and clear some more of these roots and stuff out. Uh, we'll probably just use this instead of that. Might just sell both of them. Uh, he's not quite loaded yet with wood. Put a bunch more logs on there. So I'll probably be working on that off screen too. But um, that's pretty much it on that stuff. So yeah, I'm going to go get the herbicide tractor going. almost forgot what I was doing. But you can see corn's going in the ground. Um, zero weeds, fertilized 66%, planted with corn. Uh, somewhere in my grass field, it told me how many liters it would make, so that might be after it comes up. Let's run over here real quick and show y'all that. That right here. Is that going to do it? The growth is ready to harvest. Of course, it needs plowing, needs lime. Uh, potential harvest quantity. Look like it's 108,646. So any of y'all know what that means? Potential harvest quantity. That how much we're gonna get off this field? That would be neat if it tells you how much. But uh, yeah, I got a bunch more trees to work on. Um, yeah, that's just a side thing. But let me pop to the shop real quick. All right. Um, try to get this in here. It will not fit in either door. So I'm like, oh man. Which I probably could have sold that in there, but I wasn't thinking before I unhooked it. So I ain't going to bother with it now. But we're going to kind of scroll through this again. So you, you see how many tractors I got now? We need more equipment to go with them. Um,. I'm going to go ahead and send, I don't know which trick is which, but I know I don't want this no more, so I'm going to sell it. I might as well do it while y'all are here. Ooh, I'm 45 minutes in already. We're going to have to hurry up. I did not know I was going to be that long on this. Uh, but here's our T right here. Uh, 46000 for that. And then we got this boy. All right, is there anything else? Don't look like it offhand. The wood chipper is one thing. I say I want to see, yeah, see seeds, lime, and fertilizer is what it holds. But at one, I can't get to go in there. We'll be selling this pump here too pretty soon. As soon as that other thing gets built. Uh, here's our wood chipper right here. Oh, we'll get paid for the fuel. Because that's the only thing that's left in it. Okay. I like that. Okay, that's the only thing I'm going to sell. 
Uh, wow, we're up 677,000 now, folks. Uh, Got to get a truck coming down here, get this trailer. Um, there's a plow that I'm looking at. That'll probably be in the next episode. But I'm going to leave that tractor there to get the plow. And I think this 4960 is going to go on that grain cart, maybe. I, I, I'm not for sure. So, but anyway, um, do the dosey dough -si -do here through the equipment. There we go. Philip, huh? Halfway on seeds, and he's done a round and almost a half of a through. Oh man, he probably planted right on up past all that. Oh no, 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 no. Um, we might be mowing in the next episode. We'll try that too. He did. He did. Did he go? No. These are still running that way, so he stopped right there. And you can see right there, so, yeah. All right, that'd be all right. I'll keep an eye on him next time he comes through here. Anyway, folks, I got to get off of here, so I want to appreciate all your love and support. All the comments. I love all the comments y'all been giving. That is awesome. And, um, yeah, I just appreciate everything, folks. Y'all are great. Y'all are awesome. Awesome sauce. So, till next time. Uh, I guess that's everything till next time. So, y'all have a great day. A blessed day. I love each and every one of y'all. I'll see y'all in the next episode. Get it, get it, get it in the ground. Later.